welcome back to my channel. Oh my gosh, you guys, when I am filming this video, it is December, Friday, 22nd. Two days away from Christmas, you guys. What the heck? Oh my gosh. Well, if you're not counting today, which I'm not counting today, so two more days until Christmas. One more day till Christmas Eve. Okay, if you guys are like me and you're a procrastinator, I have a lot of presents to wrap today, you guys. A lot of presents to wrap. So as you can see, I've already wrapped some presents and I've been wrapping these day by day, little by little. With little kids in the house, it is a lot harder to get everything wrapped at once. So I have been wrapping little by little each and every day. Here we are on Friday, a day away from Christmas Eve. We host Christmas Eve at our house, so our house kind of needs to be in tip-top shape, cleaned, organized, prepped, and these presents need to be done because there's no way I'm gonna have time to wrap anything on Christmas Eve. So, I have today and tomorrow to get that done. Now, I have been having lots of fun at filming all of my Christmas videos for you guys. If you're new here and you missed out on my Christmas videos that I posted, I will leave a link down in the description box below. I have a video on everything that I got my toddler for Christmas, everything that I got my eight-year-old and three-year-old boys for Christmas, and I also have a stocking stuffer and Christmas Eve box ideas video. So definitely check out those videos if you haven't already. Lots of great inspiration for Christmas. I know we are two days away from Christmas, but I know there are a lot of last minute shoppers out there, you guys. I've even been shopping out this week, shopping for things that we needed to get last minute stuff. So I know that there's still stuff out there. So I do have those videos up if you do wanna check them out. Lots of gift inspiration, and I've said this before, not only for Christmas, but also for birthdays as well, you guys. So I had a subscriber ask if I was going to be doing a wrap with me Christmas video. Now, this is something that I have been pondering about the last couple of days since I've been in the Christmas spirit and the Christmas mood of filming all these videos for you guys and everything that I got my kids for Christmas. It was something that I thought about doing. I did throw in a little wrap with me in my um, stocking stuffers video of me wrapping my husband's gifts and I really liked how that turned out. When one of my subscribers asked if I was going to be doing a wrap with me video that they love my video which you are oh so sweet which I want to get a shout out to you Danaj 4023 I'm sorry if I mispronounced that but I did want to give you credit because you definitely inspired me to hop on it and just get it done it is something that I have been pondering about the last couple of days especially since I've been wrapping a little bit here and there every day and I've been thinking should I do a wrap with me should I do a wrap with me and I'm just like no maybe tomorrow maybe tomorrow maybe tomorrow but when my subscriber asked me that down in the comments. I was like, you know what? That is so sweet. It really made me happy knowing that my videos are being watched and being loved by others. So thank you, thank you, thank you for getting me to get up and get this video filmed. And so this video is dedicated to you. So thank you, thank you. All right, you guys, I don't have a whole lot of time. Baby girl is sleeping. The boys are currently in their room playing and occupied. So I have to get through this wrapping stuff, you guys. So I'm going to move over to our kitchen table. That is where I, I have been wrapping everything. It's a lot more comfortable for me standing up and wrapping gifts than sitting down on the floor. So I'm gonna move over there, show you my little station, how I have everything set up. And then we're gonna go ahead and get right into this wrapping, you guys, because I have a lot of wrapping to do. Currently under the tree, um, I already have all of baby girl's gifts wrapped. All of her gifts are wrapped and ready to go. I have half of the boy's gifts wrapped underneath the tree and I have the rest of the half of their gifts to wrap. Um, I've already wrapped all of my husband's gifts, um, which are all along the counter up here. All of these gifts are my husband's and I just separated them out from our gifts. So then that way on Christmas day, all we have to do is just grab mine and hubby's off of the counter and give them to each other. Um, hubby is a huge procrastinator. He likes to wrap my gifts from himself the night before Christmas. That is what he does every single year. So that is his thing. Um, so anyways, um, yeah, I have all hubby's gifts wrapped, all the baby girl's gifts wrapped, and now I just need to wrap my son's gifts. Um, and then I do have some gifts in my closet for my older sister that no longer lives in our city anymore, and she did send some gifts for the kids, so I'm gonna wrap those for them because they always open her gifts on Christmas Eve, and then I send her pictures and videos of them opening them. And then I also need to wrap my younger sister's gifts, and that is it. I've already wrapped everybody else's gifts except for those, 
and the rest of the boys gifts you guys okay i feel like i've been riding for way too long so let me go ahead and show you guys my little station that i have set up so we have these three big boxes um there really isn't much in this box i've already wrapped everything that was in this box I'm going to be putting together um the night before Christmas. All of their stocking stuffers here ready to go. And then that is going to be getting put up on Christmas day. And then this goes along with it. So that's what's in this box. Um, these other two boxes, you guys have presents in it for the boys that I need to wrap. Um, so basically each kid got their own box with all their presents in it. And so I need to go ahead and finish wrapping those. Like I said, these are all of hubby's gifts that are already wrapped and ready to go. Um, this is what our tree is looking like right now. Um, this is my present from hubby. I already know what it is, so he isn't even going to bother to wrap this. Um, so that's just going to stay like that. Um, these are the boys' advent calendars. So basically they get to open up a day every single day and there is a little prize inside. Um, and these are the little mini Funko Pops. And so this is what they look like. They are so cute. Um, so they've been opening those every day. I got Benjamin Star Wars and Brody this Disney one. And then these, you guys, I set out for them to play with today. This is something that I got in my homeschool haul, but we never ended up using. So we're going to use these today. I thought it was the perfect time to use them for Christmas. And these are the Sense and Grow um, sensory snow trays. So it has like um, fake snow inside and little animals. So I thought that would be fun for them. Um, so I just wanted to show you that because these are super, super cute. If you guys don't do advent calendars with your kids, I highly recommend it um, because they are so much fun. It gets the kids you know excited for christmas they get to open something every single day and it's not too big or not too small for them um these can be a bit pricey um these are like 50 dollars each but i got them on sale for 25 dollars each when black friday came um and that is the best and that's the best way to do it you guys for black friday um don't mind my nails i am in the process of doing my nails right now um if you don't already know i do my own nails um during covid i taught myself how to do my own acrylics and my own press-on nails um so currently these are my own press-on nails and tonight i'm going to paint them like a christmas themed color um but you know with kids that can be um very hard to do so my nails have to get done in increments so yesterday i went ahead and gave myself a manicure and put on my press-ons and filed them down and everything and today I'm going to paint them. Moving along over here to my little station, nothing fancy or snazzy, okay? So over here I've got some wrapping paper. Um, a lot of this wrapping paper I've had since last year, so like the Star Wars and the Minions. I had this one last year, the superhero one. Um, and all of my wrapping paper I got from Walmart. Walmart has the best deals when it comes to wrapping paper, you guys. You can get a huge thick roll like this for $6 at Walmart. Um, so I've got all my wrapping paper set up. These are just some extra wrapping paper trimmings that might fit something here. I have my trash bag. Um, these are just like extra um, wrapping paper trimmings from over the years, from birthdays and Christmases and tissue paper. And I just use these if I have something smaller um, instead of wasting it. Um, so that's what that is. And then in this bag is all of my like Christmas boxes and bags that I've kept over the years. I used a lot for hubbies, um, but I don't like to waste stuff. Um, I think it's wasteful to just like keep buying boxes every single year. So I just save them. If they're in good condition, I save the bags, I save the boxes and we continue to use them throughout the years instead of, instead of having to keep repurchasing them. Um, these two presents I have over here because these are like special presents. These are from Santa Claus. Um, so right now we have baby girl's gift and Brody's gift and then I need to wrap Benjamin's gift from Santa. And then right here, I just have my scissors, my permanent marker, my name tags and some tape. So yeah, that is my little station, you guys. Okay, so I am going to let the boys know that they can't come out, get them some water and some snacks. They are occupied, like I said, playing and probably watching a movie in there. And so I'm gonna try to get as much wrapped as I possibly can, you guys. So if you have gifts, and I know y'all got gifts to wrap, get your wrapping paper, get your tape, get your scissors, get your gifts and come along and rap with me, you guys, all right? I'm gonna let the music play and I'm just going to get to rapping, you guys. So if you have presents to rap, 
get your presents and let's wrap together, you guys. This is your inspiration to get up and get your presents wrapped because I have definitely been dreading to wrap all of these presents, you guys. So let's do it. All right, you guys, so this is what I'm working with with Brody's box. This is how much I have left to wrap. And then this is how much I have left to wrap in Benjamin's box. So not too bad, but like I said, I don't know how much time I have. So let's go ahead. I'm gonna let this Christmas music play and let's get these toys wrapped. I mentioned that I have two trash bags that I am donating to kids that are in need of toys. These are all great, good used toys. So my kids are not hard on their toys. They aren't, they don't break them or go crazy with them. So all these toys are in good condition. So I'm gonna have hubby take these out to the homeless shelter or like a charity of some sort to donate these toys. Um, so I do have two bags full of toys. I would like to go through the playroom one last time um, and try to get rid of as much as I can. Um, but yeah, we got two bags to donate, which I am proud of. Usually I only have one bag, so I'm glad that I started another bag. So I just wanted to mention that I do go through all of my kids' toys every year before Christmas and their birthdays and try to get rid of as much as I can. So then that way they have room for their new toys.
of the gifts that I need to wrap for the boys. I got all of their wrapping done. The only things left that I need to wrap are the presents that my older sister got the kids and my younger sister's gifts. And that is it. Um, so I am done wrapping for now. As you can see, well, I guess you can't see. She wants to say hi. Say hi, mommy. Say, mwah. <laughs> Little kiss. Oh, thank you. <laughs> You're so cute. Huh? I love you. My mama. Baby. <laughs> she is so crazy. So she is ready for me to give her lots of attention. Um, so I just, yeah, she wants attention. Say hi. <laughs> you say ho, ho, ho. No, you too shy. She was saying ho, ho, ho yesterday. It was so cute. You want my attention, huh? Yeah, she said yeah. I'm gonna quickly show you guys everything that my older sister got the kids for Christmas and then I'm going to wrap that on my own time because I need to close out this video you guys I have other things to do I need to clean I need to give her lots of love and attention um, so Mort Benjamin she got him these Goosebumps Slappies World um, book collection which is really really neat if you know us, you know that I am a huge bookworm. I'm a huge book lover. I collect books. I do have a few book hauls on here if you want to check those out. Stay tuned for more book hauls from me. I'm always on the lookout for thrifted, discounted, pre-used books, you guys. Um, but I, my kids read every single day or I read to them every single day. And so she got him the one through six collection of these, which is really cool. He is going to love this. We watch the movies and the shows together. Um, so he is definitely going to love that so she got in that collection for baby girl she got her this it's called wood toe and I don't want to take it out of the bag because she's here and she's gonna be like hey what is going on and maybe you pancakes. <gasps> pancakes and so what it is is I'm gonna pop that here up on the screen and so what you do is you take the little wooden sticks and you put them in the holes and so it's really like a fine gross motor skills getting it in that hand eye coordination and then also as she grows we can say okay match the pink one to the pink hole and that can also help teach her her colors so she got her that and then she's really interested in this right now but this is what she got for Mr. Brody <laughs> and this is the pancake pile up game the stack them high, serve them up, relay race game. Yay! So I will go ahead and pop that up on the screen as well so you can take a look at what kind of game that is. Um, so I know Brody's going to love this. The whole family is going to love that. We love playing board games. Um, we have quite the collection of board games like I've mentioned before. Um, so I know he's going to love that. So I just wanted to show you guys the gifts that my sister got the kids. All right, you guys. So yeah, that is going to be it for my Christmas wrap with me this year. <laughs> Hello. I think she is going to help me end out this vlog. I don't think she's going to leave. She loves looking at herself on camera, saying hi, giving kisses, just showing off. So that is it for this video, guys. I really hope this gave you guys some inspiration on to get up and get moving and get those presents wrapped, you guys. Two more days. Two more days. And if you have family coming in this weekend, a lot of people start celebrating Christmas early, even the day before Christmas Eve. So if you have family coming in or you're going to meet family and you know you got presents to wrap, get up and get those presents wrapped because they aren't gonna wrap themselves, okay? Yay! Santa's elves are way too busy this year to be wrapping gifts, so mom and dad gotta step in and get those presents wrapped. All right, you guys, I love you guys. I love each and every one of my subscribers. Thank you guys for being here. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button on your way out. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next vlog. Stay tuned for my Christmas Eve and Christmas Day vlog. Definitely check out what I got my kids for Christmas down in the description box below. Merry Christmas, guys.